My son Matt proposed a motorcycle camping trip to Acadia National Park for Father's Day. I loved the idea, so we planned a route and made some reservations. When the day came, we met in Port. The weather forecast called for heavy rain the first day, then sunshine for the rest of the trip. We thought about delaying the day, but decided to go for it. We figured it would add to the adventure and be a good test of our gear. on the morning of day two on the way to the Seawall campground, placed any memories of rain the day before. At the Wonderland trailhead, Matt checked his camera, and we hit the trail. the sunrise from the top of Cadillac Mountain. Views on the ride back down were spectacular. On the way to Mount Blue State Park, some potential showers made for an impressive looking sky. Dixfield, Maine is the closest town of the state park. Unfortunately, they did not have any high-octane gasoline. We were hoping to pick up some groceries, but settled for a pretty good pizza for lunch. Our last day was a ride from Mount Blue back to Portland. Maine's Route 113 passes through the White Mountain National Forest along the Maine New Hampshire border. It's miles of motorcycle hill. Hurricane Mountain Road, above Conway, New Hampshire, became highly recommended. It did not disappoint. That brought us to North Conway, mountain town I've always liked. We saved riding the Kankamangas Highway for another day and headed back to Portland.